On the one hand, the economic crisis of the country is heading towards an abyss. On the other hand, a broad discourse has arisen on political turmoil that is prevailing within the Sri Lanka Potujana Peramuna owing to the recent fuel price hike. With the decision taken to increase fuel prices in the country, General Secretary of the Sri Lanka Potujana Peramuna, Attorney at Law Sagara Kariyabasam, issuing a statement, requested Minister of Energy Uday Gammampila to design from his position. Because Basil Rajapaksa is not a member of any of these subcommittees that make these decisions, I did not go and question him about this. I honestly did not know that I have to consult General Secretary Sagar Karyavasam. I consulted the President, the Prime Minister, the subcommittee appointed to look into the power crisis and the subcommittee on cost of living. But if I had known that I should consult the General Secretary, I would have done it before making the announcement of the fuel price hike. But unfortunately, the law does not say that I have to consult him. If me trying to protect the government is deemed as an issue for the people within the government, then I have to say that the enemies of the government are not outside the government, but within the government. Some people say that these are all but theatrics. I also agree. If anyone wants to understand these theatrics, I suggest them to watch the movie Enemy Within. If people without a backbone are pelting stones at us hiding in the dark, that speaks volumes about their personality. <laughs> The reason behind the fall of once a very powerful party in this country was because they lacked internal democracy within the party. We have to draw various lines within the internal democracy we have in our party. If someone crosses a line, we have to hold discussions regarding that as one party. Coming to the street and starting a commotion is not the solution. We have to take care of such a matter internally. There will be problems. It is an internal matter to manage these 11 parties who have formed a coalition with us and to listen to what everyone is saying and embark on this journey together. <laughs> This is not his personal matter. Against the prevailing situation of the country, he has decided to issue this statement. I would like to tell Minister Uday Gammanpila that we would like to express our displeasure about what happened as a party. This is a unanimous decision. This decision was not taken by Minister Uday Gammanpila. We would like to say that very clearly. We will stand by that. <laughs> On the one hand, we have to assist the general public. On the other, we have to listen to head of institutions as well when it comes to taking decisions with regard to operational activities of these institutions. No government increases the price of goods or fuel with pleasure. The president, the prime minister and the cabinet of ministers will decide as to what steps will be taken in the future regarding this matter.